welcome back. Uh, we're gonna skip that last level because it's not gonna be possible. That one's a tough one. And look, if the controls were good, then yeah, maybe. But so was this not. one, think fast. Yeah, it looked pretty fun. Six percent. Six percent. That sounds about my style. A series of mini games, and if you shut the fuck up, you can just play it. <laughs> You're like here. <laughs> Wait, it's fun so is far. Is there a secret over there? You see the openings? Yeah, no, uh, I don't think those are secrets. Nope. <laughs> a lot of people tried jumping that, though. <laughs> yes, they did. I actually... Because, like, those blocks are ice blocks. Yeah. So I tried just holding and jumping towards the door. Oh, shit. But the ice window picked me up and dropped me... Uh... <laughs> <laughs> I, hope, I hope that sound might like got in there. <laughs> There you go. There you go. No oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> I was like waiting for something to happen. <laughs> you gotta think fast. I get it. <laughs> yeah. Jesus. Jesus. Yeah. Oh my god. I like to be in. Uh, well, shit. <laughs> Someone that's not good. No. <laughs> Just wanted to bring in some suspense there. See how close I can get it. You ever worn suspenders? Yes. Really? Yes, dude. Told you I was in Catholic school. Oh yeah. <laughs> Sorry. I I had to do uh, CCD. Yeah. I didn't enjoy it. Oh yeah, it's the wrong way. Yeah, I did CCD also. Um, they told... wait. You were in Catholic school and you had to do CCD. Well, when I moved to Illinois, I started. I... I stopped going to Catholic school and I went oh, to public okay. school. But they wanted me to do the yeah, Catholic school or Catholic or the CCD stuff to mm -hmm. uh yeah, just to continue I guess. I don't know if I want to talk about religion. <laughs> I mean I was just saying that you were asking me if I've if I uh if I wore suspenders, I was in Catholic school. <laughs> I like the butt slide. Whoa! <laughs> Whoa. Good shit, man. Did you I see like how it. many people died on the saws? Oh my god. This is good. So I, this they need to make this um like a series. Like a think past. Yeah. It's almost like WarioWare. It's yeah, like right. a bunch of like little mini games. Yeah. This one you have to turn left. Yeah. I didn't know if you had to be closer or not. Oof. That one... That, you have good reflex on that one. I would have <laughs> missed that. Nice. Oof. Oh, hold the cock! <laughs> this is the cock. This is the cock one. Yeah. Damn it! Oh. I didn't go down far enough. Oof. Mm -mm. Well, let you. I think you have to jump off the cloud. Or can I, you? No, I think you can go through a door with a cloud. Oh, okay. I just think it's a proximity thing. Okay. So now that I've gotten into coding and stuff, mm -hmm. like in Unity, I'm mm -hmm. like starting to see like game mechanics. The Matrix? Yeah, no. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely not. <laughs> I'm not. I'm not very g good at it yet, but mm -hmm. I'd like to get to be. That's not the profession that I want to be in. It's just the profession that I. Like, when you're in the <laughs> arc viz industry, there's no, like, set job. Like, if you're not a jack-of-all-trades, then you're a lot less valuable valuable in that industry. Especially if you're part of a small team. Mm -hmm. So you, you can't just be like, well, I only do exteriors, or I only 3D model things. Like, you kind of have to... If you don't know a little of everything, then you're never going to be... You're never going to fit into a good team. Yeah. Plus, being good at everything, or at least knowing how everything kind of yeah. intricately works, yeah. gives you uh, more of a sense of um, how projects, how the workflow for projects are going to be. Yeah. And, like, what needs to be done sooner than later. 
think the next one's the vines. Yeah. yeah. And then this is the cloud one, yeah. Oh yeah, I think you're right. How do I get out of it? Just jump? Jump, yeah, okay. But uh, yeah, no, like you're saying, you have to be like a jack of all trades, and especially in um, the art industry, I believe. Unfortunately, yeah. I'm more of I'm I, I'm just the one, and I haven't gone more than 2D painting and drawing. Breezy, no. It's okay. Breezy. It's okay. Breezy, you're okay. You're okay. Well, it's okay, Breezy. I don't mean to yell. Just don't get into the box. But yeah, yeah, like uh, yeah. I think the bigger the team, the easier it is to fall into a single job. Mm -hmm. Um, I've never been part of a team more than six or seven people. Okay. Jesus. Yeah. For some reason, I thought that was the nice. Ooh, I, went, I went a little too early. Yeah. It's not good. At least you're getting. I was like, it's falling in. <laughs> you're doing a lot better than I was. I couldn't. I, I kept just getting to the falling platform. The one after this one. I got to the swamp, but I always like. I, I missed it, and I never got. I was able to get back to it. Yeah. Think fast. But one of my favorite part about trying to be a jack of all trades is being able to be in a position where you fit better in a team mm -hmm. um, just because you can fill those roles that like you you know what um <laughs> you know what was the bounce one yeah <laughs> you know what for some reason in my head i thought it went faster than that mm -hmm. um you know what people are good at what kind of thing mm -hmm. the aces in their places yeah you know. yeah I know too many retail shit. <laughs> retail lingual. God. Yeah. I work so much goddamn retail. As much as I hate to say this, but I hope a lot of jobs go extinct. Uh, as in they become more efficient, you mean? Yeah. Okay. Like, I went the wrong way. <laughs> uh, I um, forgot. For some reason, I thought that was the Vine one. Um, like a lot of the cashier jobs, I don't think need to be necessary. A lot of the stocking stuff, like, mm -hmm. yeah, yeah, no, I got you. Yeah. I mean, just today we went to Taco Bell for lunch. And, God damn it! <laughs> um, I'm like so focused on talking. You, you like ordered your food, um, at the cashier, and I was able to order my food off the computer screen like pretty quickly because it was. I don't know. I mean, I just wanted. I, I just wanted to take a look at their whole menu instead of having to like look up. <laughs> you see how close I yeah, I, yes, I did. Yeah, I just wanted to see like the menu itself, and it was it was still pretty good. And you know, they could they could have just not been there or not ready, and I would have just been like, I'm gonna order my food before Josh. McDonald's is doing that now. Yeah. I mean, I like the human interaction, but if the majority of your point. if the majority of your employees are assholes and don't want to be there, then why why would I want that? <laughs> yeah, yeah, like I had that lady, but I went up and politely asked, "I'm like, may may I have some ketchup?" And she's like, "Sir, how much ketchup do you want?" I'm like, "Just a handful." And she's like, she looked me dead in the in the eye, in the face. I'm like, "What?" Dead, going, dead in the eye face. Yeah. <laughs> she looked me right in the eyes, and she was like, seri and with all seriousness, she goes, Sir, your hand is bigger than my hand. I'm oh, like... My God. I'm like, okay. Is this like a McDonald's or something? Yeah, it was, it was McDonald's. Damn it. <laughs> I keep getting into talking. Uh, but yeah. She was like, Sir, your hand is bigger than my hand. Oh, my God. I'm like, yeah. Take your hand, grab some ketchup, and put it in my bag. My God, this wasn't through a drive-thru or anything like that, no, or no, right at the counter, in front of everyone too. They weren't even like busy. I do think though that everyone need like everyone needs to experience retail 
at one point or another. Retail or food service. Yeah, I suppose. Like a rite of passage. Yeah. <laughs> just so that, you know, even though you, uh, just, you're going to be out there and you're going to be at a restaurant or a store and you just need to know, like, what those people are going through. Damn it! God, the, if you, if you move, move yeah. yeah, if you move with it, it launches you in that direction. So you kind of have to stay level with it the entire time. Whoa! Whoa, why was that slippery there? Ooh. Really? Yeah. What if there was a slippery level in this? Uh, oh god. I hope there isn't. <laughs> Can't hope there is. <laughs> <laughs> um, but other than that, like, what about uh, what other jobs do you think would go extinct? Are you just talking more like food industry? Well, it's just the cashier job in general. Mm -hmm. Like, I don't. I. I just don't like like it. Do you it's, like the express lanes at like Meyer and stuff like that? Uh, yeah. Yeah. But what I hate being asked every single time is, do you uh, do you want to sign up for a credit card? Do you want to <laughs> do you want a protection plan? Like I hate protection plans. Do you, have you ever actually used a protection plan? I tried to, and it didn't work, so I never did it again. Yeah. yeah. <sighs> like I had one at the my own company that I worked for at Toys R Us. Mm -hmm. This made me so angry. It was, ah, uh, damn it. This is, it was $34 on a, uh, from a piece that was $2.99. I think it was the Wii. Okay. Um, and it was $34 for 24 months. Okay. And, uh, my Wii stopped reading discs. Okay. I'm like, oh, I'll just use my protection plan. Yeah. And I had to pay, I think it was $80. Yeah. To get it replaced. Mm -hmm. But it's like, why did I spend... The protection. Yeah. yeah. He's like, sir, that's not how our insurance works. You still have to pay for the fact that we want your money. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, a lot of the protection plans, especially for electronics, work that fucking way. And what? I pressed up! Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! That's your own. I love those primal grunts. I really wanted to just whip the controller. <laughs> I'm not violent. Yes. <laughs> God damn it, Tim. <laughs> you got this. Well, oh yeah. This is a, this is a different experience playing a game while trying to talk. Yeah. About a specific subject in mind. Yeah. I think if I... Now that I did this, if I go back to playing a different game, I'm going to be just better at it. <laughs> just be, like, really, really, really good at yeah. it. Especially ones like this, which require memory and, like, muscle memory and mm -hmm. timing and stuff. You just kind of lose focus on what you're talking about, or if anything you're talking about actually matters. <laughs> There you go, yeah! Ooh, that was a little easy. Oh, there you go, there's your ice level. <laughs> there he is! Yes, son, you got it! <laughs> just continue walking. Yeah, I oh, I was hoping the icicles would drop down. <laughs> what was that at the end? If he doesn't move forward, he just ducks down. Do you like it? Yeah, I like that one a lot. Nice. You like those uh miss those puzzle ones? Yeah, because like that added a, a different sense. It added a sense of discovery and like a sense of timing. So like, even if I died, I still wanted to see what that next level was. Mm -hmm. So like that's that's like a perfect way to do that. Nice, especially when you make them short like that. Auto switch to sky high. <clears throat> what if I like auto switch stuff? Puzzle solving auto Mario. No, that was one of my favorite. Um, things about Mega Man, even though Mega Man's were frustratingly hard, like no matter how many times you died, you still wanted to know mm -hmm. what power up you got from beating that boss and how yes. to beat that boss and what power ups are good against bosses. Like I feel like that that um whoa what oh I can't get this <laughs> you can still move when you're there. Oh and man. I'm dead. Okay, so yeah, don't grab those. <laughs> yeah. yeah, right. Wait, what? 
Oh, you have to jump in between them. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Sounds like Link when you roll a lot. <laughs> Are you supposed to get in front of them? Can you run before How? they get there? Yeah. No. Oh, you can roll? Apparently. No way. How do they do that? Is it is it R when you're crouching like that? Okay. Oh, it yeah. is. It okay. is. Okay. That's dumb. Don't don't even finish this level. This level's dumb. Oh. I just <laughs> want to say it. Be yeah, yeah. Whoops. Mess that up. Might as well start over. Yeah, I think you do need to miss that first one though, and run okay. for the yeah. Okay. Whoops. Shit. Definitely not that. I do like he smacked his head on that though. <laughs> He's like, Damn it. Boing! Yeah, I know. Alright, let me try. Damn it! Almost. Are you an achievement hunter? No. No, I'm not. Yeah, me neither. You might as well start that. We'll see, we'll see, we'll see. You ain't getting it. I'm telling you right now. Oh. <laughs> Look at how many people died yeah, right at the right edge. there, yeah. Damn it. Stop! Alright. <laughs> no, you can keep going. I'm just oh. telling you to stop smashing your face on that <laughs> beginning part. No, yeah. beat it. Beat it. Go back right now, or we're done forever. Alright, fine. All right, guys, I'm going. I'm going back. I got this. <laughs> I got this. Damn it! Do you? I think I want to go back to this topic because I like it. Yeah. But um, do you agree that in your childhood your creativity was trying to be stunted by people that? Oh man, okay. that didn't agree with your path. Like, you know. Uh, like it was looked down upon? My creativity was? Mm -hmm. mm. Or your willingness, your wanting to go towards a creative career? Um, Creative career, like I said, it it never oh, was man, supposed to. Oh you got to, this. It was never supposed to be like game art design until uh, Westwood showed up. But uh -huh. like, when my friends nice. were, there we go. But when my friends wanted to make the RPG, mm -hmm. like, that's when I seriously think, started thinking about it. Mm, okay. But, um... <laughs> yeah. I think I can get a copy of RPG Maker if you want to make one. I don't know how... It was... I don't. Yeah. I mean... Please don't edit him. I didn't know how I pressed that. It was a... Uh, Wait, was... what was that one? Oh, boy. Was it? Auto Switch Madness? Oh. Uh, it doesn't look like we beat that one. Yeah, but it has a really high percent achievement. Oh, really? That's why I didn't want to do it. Oh. It's like 27% people. I was like, oh, cool. Cool. Oh. You almost beat that your first try. <laughs> like, my mindset now is just, uh, like, super into... Uh, mm -hmm. speed running and like just knowing like okay if I make this jump I'm probably gonna whatever they set up will probably have me go through it pretty easily mm. ah. you want another thing that I wanted to, want to talk about is um, like redemption like you okay. know how some games are have been failing a lot lately okay. so, especially since the Kickstarter uh, thing has started okay yeah. um no Man's Sky. Oh my god. Dude. That game fun. 
has made a complete turnaround and they're about to announce something that adds a better multiplayer experience because that was like one of the things that they got knocked on from yeah. the beginning didn't have yeah, a multiplayer. Sean Murray. I, I, Sean Murray is actually one of my favorite people right now. Okay. Um, because I keep of the, missing yeah, this one. Yeah. It's hard because you... I see the mushroom thing. Yeah, the like, mushrooms. Like that one stage you were doing. Yeah. Like, he definitely got the shit end of the stick, especially on such a game, a game that's so ambitious. Mm -hmm. And in a world where everyone just feels entitled to exactly what they're promised, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. Like they, any other instance, Jesus, any other, any other instance, they feel that they haven't got gotten everything that they deserve. They don't say anything unless they already paid for it. Unless you want to keep talking, unless you want to keep talking about that subject, I can keep going because I know you. It's hard. It's hard for you to talk unless like this subject you want to keep talking. I can't shut up. I'm trying to play. <laughs> 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 That's pretty good. Um, no, but I, I did want to go back to the creativity thing. Oh yeah, like, yeah, yeah. I yeah. didn't I didn't feel like my creativity was stunted in any way. That okay. My my parents were more like um not not necessarily your parents, but keep going. Ten <sighs> seconds speaking. I mean like there was my art teacher who was like a uh uh, she was a studio artist, and when I saw how hard, like, the fact that she was teaching and mm -hmm. and was still trying to sell paintings and stuff like that, make, oh, trying to make okay. it, yeah. I didn't have anyone like that in my life. Yeah, and I, I just, I just, <laughs> wow. Oh, I'm supposed to just fall on that one. Yeah. Um, I just knew right off the bat, like, okay, maybe not, maybe art's not the way to go but what about you like did Damn, you have someone that um stunting your creativity well i think it was just i didn't have i don't have anyone that stands out okay. um as remembering but i do remember multiple instances um of being encouraged to go towards something else mm -hmm, mm -hmm. um and i just remember being so angry I remember it was a really young age. Like originally, um, I wanted to do comics. Like yeah, I yeah. was really into comics, and I would draw what I would see. I was uh, I was even thinking of life in a panelized format, mm -hmm. where like subjects were. Um, Jesus, oh, definitely don't jump there. Um, I like how you put that block there to, to indicate where to there. jump. Yeah, I was thinking of life in this panelized format, which is interesting yeah. for a while. I was yeah. really into draw or comics also. Yeah. I love drawing comics. How are we going to talk? Oh, yeah. 23. You can do it. Um, oh, that stupid evolution of Mario thing. <laughs> so dumb. Ooh, here we go. 15. Wiggler of... Vault. Fifteen out of three thousand. Jesus. Okay. Oh my god, man, that's scary. Point one five percent. Space pig. What? I oh, think you're too oh. close to that. I think I had to let the. Whoops. God damn it. But any any instance that I see someone stunt creativity, yeah, stunt creativity, I try to what the actual fuck rationalize it. So I've been seeing a lot, a lot lately. Um, not anyone that I'm close to, but a lot of like hearing a lot of things. Like when a teacher grades a paper and say the kid makes a doodle. Mm -hmm. Like I think Gary um, Gary brought that up in on Facebook about how he was always penalized for a drawing on the side of the paper yeah and like i remember being penalized too for that and it like really stunted especially if i finish something early you know like don't like if you don't want me to draw on it then say don't draw on it but don't <laughs> penalize me yeah yeah for having a creative mind and filling in the blank spaces of your page. Damn it. <clears throat> i don't see what to do next though 
Like, yeah, I don't see it either. I'm trying to. Oh, I'm gonna try to do that flop one next. Okay. If I can find out what, how to, which one that was. Whoops. Oh, uh, okay. So it finishes it yeah. and then it goes. Okay. Got it. I didn't know that was gonna hit that on switch. I thought you had to hit it. Yeah, I know. Mm -hmm. Neither did I. You know what we should find? We should find boss levels. Like, where, boss level. Yeah, where you have to fight like one of the Bowser um, kids. Damn it! Okay. Isn't there? I thought we ran into some of those. I don't. I don't know if those are like themed for that. Okay. I kind of want to see if there's like <sighs> a traditional Mario level with like a boss at the end or. Mm -hmm. Well, the traditional ones are what those axes. Yeah. No, not not that kind of format. Damn it! <laughs> okay. Oh, I, yeah. I want to go back to No Man's Sky. So, like, the fact that they were able to um, invest as much time as they did on the back end and make that all free. Mm -hmm. Um, is awesome because what they delivered in the beginning I felt like it was a $60 game mm -hmm. like I felt like you got what you paid for like you got this immersive procedurally generated um, impressively ambitious game it just didn't have a lot of content it was mostly relying on that procedural generation yeah but since they added so much and they've actually kind of gone back and made sure that it's everything that they they promised and um what the fuck i think you just have to fall i tried that but i think i went straight to the lava okay or at least the last time i tried okay there's someone getting cranky oh there's someone getting cranky yeah. <laughs> <laughs> all right but i i do not like where um, games are going because I feel like we're I all... feel like we're in the mumble rap version of video you know, gaming right yeah where it's the lowest common denominator right yeah. it's heavily saturated lowest common denominator is getting the most attention most attention yeah, yeah I totally agree it's like auto chess I mean I don't like the idea of auto chess mm -hmm. I get it but it's just like why do I want to just <laughs> we can play a different one. This I know what I just want. Like it's <laughs> you yes, no, it play another one. It's a sense of discovery in the yeah, I, yeah, and like oh, I got past that part. Okay, cool. Yeah, it's exactly what Dark Souls is really good at. Oh damn! You almost skipped that entire thing. <sighs> Although I think you might want to stay on that one. Did you see the thwomp? Yeah, yeah. It looked like you wanted to go up. That part, too. I know. <laughs> why Why add that? Oops. What? Mm. Oh. Timing was off. Yeah. But yeah, since so many people were interested in No Man's Sky, and it fell short on its delivery, mm -hmm. no one wanted to give it a redemption mm -hmm. back, right? Mm -hmm. No one wanted to go back because they've already been swindled, mm -hmm. or they mm -hmm. felt like they got swindled. Mm -hmm. This it, is a, zero point, a point zero 0.09. Oh my god. How, how old are we on time zone? Oh, we're at 30. Okay. Um, maybe next time. Yes. Okay. Next time. I cheat your game. Somewhere else. Thanks for watching. Giggle. No, busy, no. <laughs> <laughs>